Breaking news in York County, a small plane crashed into a vehicle just off the turnpike. Taylor Tashef is live at that scene. Now live with breaking news, this is ABC 27 News at 5. Good evening to you. I'm Alicia Richards. I'm Dennis Owens. Lots to talk about. We were following several developing stories in the mid-state. Lebanon city officials say three young people are dead after a shooting last night. Two of them under the age of 10. In Harrisburg, we have learned more tonight, a lot more actually, about a police standoff and hostage situation that ended with a suspect shot and the dramatic rescue of a two-year-old girl. But we're beginning with breaking news in York County. A plane crashed into a vehicle near the turnpike just about two hours ago. Taylor Tashef is at that scene right now. She has the latest. Taylor. Dennis, Alicia, we are live at the interchange here right between the Turnpike and 83 right here in Fairview Township, York County. This is where a small plane crashed earlier this afternoon. You could see it right behind me. It is on the ground right next to the off ramp. Now, this is what we do know right now. This all happened at 235 this afternoon. Two people were inside the fixed wing single engine Cessna when it crashed into utility truck that was driving one of um, one of the ramps here. Those two people inside the plane were hurt. One went to the hospital by helicopter, the other by ambulance. We're told the driver of the utility truck was not injured. While we do not know yet exactly why the plane went down, we can tell you the capital city airport is very close by less than two miles from where we're standing right now. Emergency officials say this is not the kind of thing they're used to dealing with, but thankfully it's exactly the kind of thing first responders are trained to handle. It is an unusual event. It, it is. It's not something that you hear about every day. Um, you, you hope that you don't hear about these things, um, but uh, sometimes they do occur and it's just good to know that we have uh, all of these first responders here that, that are ready at a moment's notice to respond and, and do everything they can to help people. And I just talked to the spokesperson for the Pennsylvania Turnpike. He says the entire Harrisburg West interchange is closed, meaning no one can get on or off right here. Uh, there is also some traffic issues on 83 in the area as well, so keep that in mind if you're heading out. And I will be back again with more information coming up in our next half hour. But for now, live in York County, Taylor Tashef, Alicia Dennis, I'll send it back to you. Taylor, great job there. Thanks so much.